Yo, this event is trash, man. It's trash. <laughs> Alright, so if you don't know what this Summer Sea Breeze event is, it's pretty much that it's a gacha pond and there's a chance to get skins like at 0.12%. And of course, every time you pull, uh, the pools get smaller, so it raises the chance of everything else. And it is trash because, first of all, as a free-to-play player or whatever, um, I'm not even away or anything. I just got like battle pass or whatever. And they only give you five coins. So it's pretty much just five pulls. And then of course, for they get like 100 dark crystals for like the next four days. And then nucleus, red nucleus pull. Um, you can use that to buy the coin. But the coins are, dude, the coins are expensive. <laughs> they cost 100 each, right? That's a lot for one for a chance to get the skin or whatever. I mean, I'm not even mad about the skin part, to be honest. The problem is this event is whale and pay to win. Like it incentivizes more pay to win stuff. It just makes the gap bigger because of these stuff here. Like I don't mind if the gacha itself just had like just the skins and then you just gotcha the skins or whatever just have like more filler skins or whatever but now you have like summons and shards and equipment upgrade and j joint supply chips oh my god they limit you right to get these and then you can get extra one now oh my god this because it actually gives you an actual advantage right so and and the only way to get you can't even grind or farm the coins, which is kind of pissed off. So this this trash this trash event is just it's just there. <laughs> and then of course, if you, you in order to get this, you have to whale. Like the skins are nice, I wouldn't mind getting it, but they you can get five. Like I was, to be honest, when I first saw this, I was thinking, yo, five coins a day. They're not so bad, right? You can maybe get like a fourth of this or whatever. Um. But no, you just get five, and that's it. And it's like, I don't know how many items are in here if I add them all up, but five out of all of this is pretty low, right? So it's just it's just so bad, man. It's so expensive, especially when they announce a new character coming, right? So usually people want to save for that, right? They can't, they won't even use it. So this this just having like an, a whale event, just or or a pay to win event. Especially at the beginning. Oh my god. That, I'm sorry, man. Ugh. Trash, dude. Anyway, this is my history. I got Colossal Arm Shard and then, yeah, the Booster Module and the Gold. To be honest, they shouldn't even have the blue ones in there. That, that will make it slightly better, right? You don't even need these in here. Just only have purples and higher. So it makes it worth it to pull. Like, if you start, if you pull and you just get these, bro, you'd be hella mad. Or, you know, just have it, you can just buy the skins right off, right off the bat. Why do I have a gotcha skin? A skin for gotchas? But even if it was, they should only have skin. They shouldn't have any of these pay-to-win stuff. So, uh, I don't know, man. I feel like I'm getting left out here because I can't get these extra pulls and stuff like that. That's what I care about. These things, okay? Well, that's my rant video. It's pretty short. I just, <sighs> come on, Tar fans. You got to step it up, man. You got to. The, the boss event is fine, right? You just join teams. I've been doing a lot of event uh, boss runs. I did been doing boss runs anyways, like almost almost every day uh, with my crew. So uh, Solarius, if you guys want to join, Venerus is the guild name. Uh, if you, you can comment down below, I'll give you the name. I'll type it out. Um, but, oh my god. <laughs> Come on, Power Fantasy, please. Please. Have an event that is like, you can at least grind for the currency. Make it hard. I don't know. Whatever. Grindable. 